Hi everyone, I hope that you are doing well, feeling good, feeling great, maybe. Um, however, not everyone, we're not always feeling good. It's not always a good day. We're not always in a good mood. Some, t some days we cry, we feel bad about our life. We feel like we're a failure or um, we're a loser or that we are losing steam, that our life is worthless and meaningless. Um, we don't have a sense of where are we going? What is the purpose of my life? How can I, what is my life going to look like? It's, you know, we think that our life sucks and that we suck. And I just want to share and remind you that we all go through these difficult thoughts and days and moments. We all have had that experience, maybe even feeling suicidal. Um, however some people get more depressed than others and it becomes more of a mental um i don't want to say disorder but it becomes something that requires medical attention and, and more care but for our typical feeling low missing our family feeling bad about our body um feeling low about our relationship status whatever it is our job our finances like we're losing money Whatever it is that you're going through or that is heavy on your heart, I just want to let you know that you're not the only one and that it's totally normal and natural for us to go through life and to have those days or those moments, those valleys. And the key is to remember that you're not broken, there's nothing wrong with you, and that what you're thinking is probably not true. And it's probably a lie that our mean inner voice says to us when we're dissatisfied with some area of our life. And it's a really huge topic, but for the purpose of this video, I just want you to know that you are more than enough you are an amazing human being despite what you are doing, what you're not doing, what you're living, what you have, what you don't have. That's okay. And just remember, there's always someone going through an even harder time dealing with even deeper issues and, and shit than you are. And maybe your problems are not as serious as other people have it on the big scheme of things like death, death of a loved one or not being able to feed yourself or your family literally like not having enough or owing most of your money to the bank and not having enough to support for your living arrangements day to day. So just remember that, remember that there are some people who need gastric bypass um, because they are so overweight and that's not good or bad but it's just a fact and they might be wishing to look like you or have your body. There are people who are in a relationship who would wish to be single again, who have kids, who would wish to not have kids and vice versa. So remember that your issues in comparison to someone else's might not be as big or impactful as they could be and we tend to exaggerate and make things a bigger mountain in our head than they really are so please don't make a hell in your own thoughts in your own life within yourself if no one else is doing it to you don't add that harm and hurt to yourself at least give yourself a little bit more peace as much as possible be gentle and kind with yourself and remember that all the hardships of life pass as well things come and go the good times and the bad times and as long as we can just remember that little thought this too shall pass then maybe we can bear the moment, bear the pain, bear the discomfort a little bit more and day by day you will survive through it, you will get through it and you will adapt to the situation and the key is to adapt for the better 
make something good out of what you are going through be resourceful use what you have in your hands the difficulties and the hardships use it in your favor however you can make something good ask god to help you make something good out of it how can you turn out of this seeming mess that you're making up in your head how can you turn this into something useful better for you helpful beneficial or how can you just simply have a plan or come up with a strategy a solution and you don't have to do it alone if you need help with that just let me know i am a certified and trained life coach and i do provide coaching to my friends and family as much as they need that from day to day on a daily basis so um, i'm available if there's anything that you want to talk through and other than that you have people that you trust in life you have resources and your fingertips anyways so use what you have at your disposal and remember that there's nothing wrong with you you're not broken and you're not dysfunctional you are simply a human being having a human life experience and this is part of the ride so take it one day at a time and here we are we're all in this together and you're going through hard times I've gone through hard times and it hurts and we'll get through it and the key is to finding out how you can manage it with your own life in your own conditions and knowing that when you ask for help it will come to you so let's remain open and flexible welcoming of the good insights and energy from the right sources and adaptable to how you are changing because your life is changing and you're becoming an even more evolved person because of the hardship that you're going through right now whatever that is it's not small it's not meaningless it matters to you and because it matters it will make a difference in your life for the good so let's set that intention. May this work for your greatest good and for benefit. And may goodness come out of this situation. And so it is. So you take care of yourselves and I'll see you soon. Stay well, stay smiling, and see you, see you again. Bye for now from Jen at Personal Power Wellness Coaching and Life Living. Living is every day, so make the best of this moment here and now. See you. Namaste.